we want to get another check of the day for the day's forecast with Ashton Altieri. Ashton, you're in for Scott this morning, and I think I figured out why. I think he didn't want to be the bearer of bad news regarding the <laughs> yeah, right? digits yeah. coming back. I, I think you're on to something, Madison. <laughs> I think you're definitely on to something. Yeah, Scott only likes to be here when there's good news to share, <laughs> and unfortunately, we have uh, some rough news for the new week here in terms of weather for North Texas after getting just a little bit spoiled uh, for our region of the country over the last couple of weeks with temperatures either at or a little below normal. Today, we start to go back to very uncomfortably hot weather. Hottest day in about two weeks, in fact, for the DFW area on the way. The heat index as high as 107. And unfortunately, no rain at all in the forecast for this week. Nothing that would come through and help cool things down even briefly. We're right around 80 degrees right now in the DFW area, waiting for the sun to come up at 640. It feels like 83, but it could feel as high as 107 this afternoon. So no surprise, the National Weather Service has hoisted up a heat advisory. This does include Collin County, Dallas County, Denton, and uh, the, uh, the Tarrant County area, and the rest of North Texas for the most part. South and east, you've been spared for now, but it's not like it's going to be a cool day in Sulphur Springs or Corsicana, Hillsboro, Waxahachie. It's going to be toasty everywhere. In fact, Waxahachie gets up to about 94 this afternoon, Denton 96, McKinney and Plano about 95. But again, you factor in the humidity, it's going to feel much, much worse than that. Over the last couple of weeks, we've had these little upper level weather disturbances close to the region, which is unusual for us this time of year. Typically, these stay farther north, but it's been a nice little relief. Instead, those systems now move away from us. High pressure is able to move back into the region. This is like a mountain of heat that's just going to stick around right on through next weekend and probably beyond that as well. We're going to be keeping an eye on the drought monitor in the coming weeks with not much rain in the forecast. Right now, we're abnormally dry across much of the Metroplex. That's the precursor to drought. It's hard to believe we're even discussing this considering how wet it was. Uh, through the spring months, but of course, this is what summer has done, just dried us out really quick. So 98 today, again, heat index up to 107, 99 tomorrow, and then triple digits on the actual thermometer starting Wednesday. And that will continue through the weekend. In fact, through Friday, every day will be hotter than the day that comes before it. Remember, Car uh, Carmen and Madison, I'm just the messenger here. Big Texas heat is back.